I don't know what he was trying me to like. He was trying to look for an answer. I don't know. I don't know if he was faking it, or, but I think I did, did, did a good job. You did a good job. Basically, just say link to all the fans of Canada and asking for them to watch you on Sunday on CTV and DAZN, and then we'll do the same thing in French. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Hey, it's me. You know, you know what you're doing. Hey, it's me. This is LDT. Everybody, please tune in for the game this Sunday. It's going to be an awesome game. I'm really privileged to be here. Thanks again for the support. Let's tune in. Perfect. And I think you should do one of those guys up here. Same thing. In French. It's French. We'll do, we want to tune in as well for CTV. Let's do one more time in English for C just to make sure it's very good. Watch on CTV, CTV. and DAZN. And DAZN? Yes. Dezone. Hi everybody in Canada, this is Laurent duvernay tardif straight from Miami for the Super Bowl 54. Don't forget to tune in for the game on CTV and there's... There's own! There's own, Because you guys spell it so weird, right? It's like D-Z-N... D-A-Z-N, but it's D-Z-O. All right, I'll do it one more time. What's up everybody in Canada, this is Laurent duvernay tardif straight from Miami. Thanks again for the support, it's been crazy here. Super Bowl 54 coming up next Sunday. Don't forget to tune in CTV or The Zone. All right, looking forward to play. Perfect, and like then that. one more in, in, in French, French for yes. Uh, RDS. Yes. Thank you. Salut tout le monde, mon... Uh, Salut tout le monde, mon... Salut tout le monde à Montréal, Québec, partout au Canada qui parle français. Laurent Zonet Tardif en direct de Miami. Merci tout le monde du support. C'est fou le flot d'encouragement que j'ai reçu les deux dernières semaines. Merci de, pour ce beau moment-là. Et puis j'ai essayé de vous rendre fier. Stay tuned sur RDS pour le match ce week-end. Let's go, Chiefs! Thank you so much. Jeez, I'm like a translator. <laughs> Laurent, you're clearly a guy of many talents. Where do you find the time to play football? I mean, football is a passion, and uh, when you reach the Super Bowl, I mean, you can't complain. You just put the time and you do it. We got to win this thing. But when you haven't been playing football, you've been busy these last few years. Yeah, for the past, uh, what, five years, I've been uh, going back home every off season to uh, study medicine, complete my MD, and I finally got graduate uh, last year. So it's uh, it's an awesome feeling. It's a great accomplishment, and to be able to be here this week and uh, and, and play in the biggest game that I probably ever play in, it's a privilege. Are you sure you can do this job as well? Do you want to go to the Olympics ever in Canada? <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. But, uh, the national broadcaster, CBC, invited me to uh, Pyeongchang to uh, cover the Olympic, and uh, it was an awesome experience, you know, just getting to meet other athletes that are going through the same struggle, but in a completely different environment, you know, and those individual sports, uh, I respect so much those athletes for their mental strength and, and also their their ability to, like, rel relentlessly train for four years in order to perform for that one moment. And it's uh, it, it was an honor for me to be there and, uh, and to be their voice and, and to try to uh, make, them, make them shine, yeah. <laughs> what about your story, though? It's pretty unique. Here you are on the verge of stepping onto the biggest stage of them all. I mean, honestly, the only thing that comes to mind right now is uh, how privileged I am to be here. It's uh, it's crazy, but at the end of the day, you know, uh, the moment you start training camp every year, that's your vision. You know, you want to get to the Super Bowl, you want to get to the biggest game. So, uh, I think for me, the, the best way that I cope with kind of uh, that stress and that atmosphere right now, and, and, and to really prepare myself to the best of my ability, is to to realize that there's no other place I want to be, you know, and uh, and, uh, and next Sunday is going to be fun. What's it like playing on this offensive line when you 